Hello everybody, my name is Worley and welcome to the channel. Today we're going to be using soursop as our main ingredient. A very popular fruit in Latin America and the Caribbean that it will prove itself to be a fantastic addition to your ingredient list. So let's get into it. Soursop, also known as guanabana in Latin America, is a slightly acidic fruit that tastes like a combination of strawberries with a creamy texture similar to coconut or banana. The flesh of the fruit consists of an edible pulp fiber and a core of indigestible black seeds. The first smoothie is a combination of soursop, pineapple and lemonade. Start by cutting the fruit in two, remove the core and separate the flesh from the skin. Place a pulp in a bowl, add a little bit of water and mix it to soften the pulp. Place the pulp in a strainer, set aside the juice. Cut the pineapple and set aside I'm going to be using lemonade today as my liquid base, but you can change it for any other such as water, milk, or even green tea. Make sure the lemonade is properly sweetened if you're making it yourself. I recommend making a simple syrup and using sweet limes for it. Once you have all the ingredients ready, place them on a blender, add ice, and the sweetener of choice. I'm going to be using honey today, but you can change it for sugar, coconut sugar, or brown sugar. Pulse a couple times to break the ice and blend until smooth. If you want a thinner smoothie, add a little bit more liquid and blend again. This smoothie tastes best when it's very cold, so keep an eye on that. For the second smoothie, we will be mixing soursop, mango and a dash of cinnamon for the final touch. In the blender, add the soursop, pulp, mango, ice, honey and a dash of cinnamon. Pulse a couple times then blend until smooth. Fits the consistency with a bit more water if needed and ice to your liking. The last smoothie today is soursop and strawberries. Following the same steps as before, add the ingredients on the blender, pulse and blend until smooth. Blueberries, raspberries and blackberries also work well with soursop, as long as they're nice and sweet. Thank you everybody for watching my very first YouTube video. It was quite challenging but I had a lot of fun making it. I would love to read your comments regarding the video, whether you liked it or not, and I would also like to know your favorite food combinations. If you enjoy the content, please subscribe so you can keep an eye on my next videos. Have a wonderful day, and I'll see you in the next one.